Team, keep it clean. What it do, baby? It's Thing Graven here with another video. I just realized I hadn't seen y'all today. So it's been a little minute. But anyway, DeAndre Hopkins, who a lot of us been waiting, wondering, seeing what's going to go down. We done heard rumors. Oh, the Ravens would be a good fit. The Chiefs would be a good fit. The Bills would be a good fit. The Browns would be a good fit. And then it was said last week. That DeAndre Hopkins could start taking some free agent visits very, very, very soon. And he's doing just that now. Because he finally got his first official visit lined up. And who's it? Is it one of the teams that was said that they could be interested in him? No. It's with the Titans. It's with the Titans. And, and I hadn't heard. Let me know if y'all did because I didn't. But I hadn't heard anything about the Titans being interested in one DeAndre Hopkins. But when you think about it. It kind of makes sense because he used to play for the Texans. And you know, y'all know NFL teams, they can be very, very petty. I mean, even if you take the petty part out, like it's DeAndre Hopkins. So this would be the best receiver on that team. But at the same time, you got to throw the pettiness in there because it's still a part of the game and part of the business. But DeAndre Hopkins, um, the, the, the Tennessee Titans, it feels like they are headed on a downward slope. Um, so I wonder if this is a legitimate visit to where, well, obviously it's a legit, legitimate visit on the Titans part, but I wonder if it's a legitimate visit on DeAndre Hopkins part, as in he would be interested to actually join the Tennessee Titans, or if this is a visit to sort of build him up. If this is a, a visit to sort of build uh, the want for DeAndre Hopkins up amongst other teams. Because y'all know how it goes. Happens every year. There can be a free agent just sitting out there. Sitting out there, posted up, chilling, ready to be signed. And nobody's biting. Nobody's going for it. But then that free agent, you hear a rumor, oh, this team's interested in him. Oh, this team's making a visit with him. Then it's like, oh, then another team will be like, oh, you know what? No, no. Oh, they, they making a visit with him? Okay, no, we got to get one too. So then... As all these visits start happening, the price it starts going up, and that helps out that free agent because that helps him get that much more money. So I wonder if this is like real on DeAndre Hopkins' part, or if it's just like uh, whatever. Now, what it kind of does remind me of. Now we know it ain't. Well, hopefully, it don't end up being the same, but but it, it probably won't be. But it kind of reminds me of. Um, <laughs> Remember when the uh, Falcons They cut uh, Julio Jones Y'all remember that Now I, I'm not saying that DeAndre Hopkins is Where Julio Jones was uh, But When the Falcons cut Julio Jones um, No they didn't cut him They were said to have Because they, they traded him That's what they did They traded him They traded him to the Tennessee Titans And they, they, they picked him up And it, it never Really worked out there um, I, I know in Madden and if, When I see Julio Jones As a free agent I sign him And then I transition him To a tight end Because it's, it's like A little glitch But anyway um, so I, I could see them being willing to go for DeAndre Hopkins because they've shown like, hey, if you were once one of the or the best receiver in the league, you may be a little past your prime, right? We we willing to take a shot. We willing to take a shot. And with DeAndre Hopkins, um, is he past his prime? Yeah, probably. Probably more so on a close to the back end. But it ain't like he's a sorry receiver, nothing like that. DeAndre Hopkins still DeAndre Hopkins. The man can still play. Last year, no year, he did have some injuries and whatnot. He missed some time. He had the, the, the suspension, too. But <laughs> he can still play. Now, th there's been a lot of talk. I know, um, and this happens sometimes. You know, NFL is a funny business. Um, when DeAndre Hopkins got cut, I, I had never heard this before, ever, ever. It, throughout the entirety of his career, I never heard anything that, or any team questioning his character. I never heard anything like that before. He gets cut, becomes a free agent. Then all of a sudden, he comes out, oh, DeAndre Hopkins got character issues. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It just seemed a little, the, the timing of it seemed a little strange to me. But hey, maybe that's me. But another thing that's come out is that DeAndre Hopkins got separation issues. He, he can't separate like he once could. That was a report that came out the other week, too. And I'm thinking, like, hold up. DeAndre Hopkins wasn't never nobody who was like, Blowing past people on the field like that. DeAndre, to me, he always seemed like a uh, 
a, ju- a jump ball receiver. The 50 if it's 50 50 with a corner and DeAndre Hopkins, then it's more like 80 20, something like that. Uh, because he'll go up and get it. He's always been known to me, in my eyes, as a really good route runner. Uh, just amazing hands, can make all these crazy types of catches, does not drop the ball, uh, and can make you some insane plays consistently. But as far as him being a speedster and all that, getting crazy separation, Ah, that no, that ain't to me. Hey, maybe I could be wrong about my analysis of D Hop, but I never really got that from him like that. So anyway, uh, we'll see. We'll see about this whole little Titans visit. See if it's something real or it's just so he could build his name up. And again, uh, whatever it is, if it is real, if it's legitimate, okay, hey, great for DeAndre Hopkins. But if it's for him to build up his name in free agency, I get it. I get it. It's a business. It's a business. Like NFL, they treat some free agent players like the girl at school who nobody's attracted to. So nobody's attracted to it. Nobody's talking to anything like that. Nobody's paying her any mind. Then all of a sudden, one guy's like, oh, you know what? She's kind of cute. And then from a lot, a lot of other guys seeing that one guy be like, oh, she's kind of cute. They're like, oh, wait, you know what? Wait a minute. She is kind of cute. You know what, so that, that first guy, he's getting at it. Then all these other guys, they start trying to get at it too. Then all of a sudden, she got all this attention out of nowhere. Could that same thing be happening with DeAndre Hopkins? Well, we'll see. Team, keep it clean. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. And like, it seems like DeAndre Hopkins trying to be when it comes to being a free agent. We out.